Something they are looking right in front of you every single day. You know, something that takes you off the comfort zone, something that makes you run. Alright. One thing that kicks away all of the excuses. You know, for me, Camry mm, was is that motivation. He is in himself an inspiration. Right, say hello to Ken Virginia. Mm, it's it's feeling sleeping right now. I remember when he when he came in first, hearing that song, this boy responded, even a child, first day, you know, when he is has been singing the song. Alright, composed that song. I wrote it, I went and I produced the song. He knows the sound. And when he was crying, it was first handed over to me. I sang the song and this boy kept quiet and was listening sound sound code i'm gonna de- i'm gonna do de- i'm gonna deal on the training with sound code come all right uh yeah sleep, he's sleeping right now mm-hmm. your babies they hear you the rock the the animate inanimate things they hear sound everything was made by sound Mm. I just love the way he's sleeping right now. Look how cute he is. Very cute. Very cute. All right. Thank you, mommy, for giving me this moment. With all right, goodness, how you guys doing? Mm. I know you guys love that. You guys love babies. You should be. I know you love that. How you guys doing? Ah. Mm. How you guys doing? Talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me. You fired up. All right. Mm. I had a beautiful sleep. I was napping and we slept together. And funny thing, we woke up together and he's, he's having his round too. Mm. How are you guys doing? So you guys talk to me. Talk to me. Mm. Bigger and better every day. Come on, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, yeah, I'm really going to do that inner training with sounds all right sound cool 
you made ten thousand dollars on my session last night amazing that's that's good that's good all right winner make sure you're winning and protecting okay uh make sure you're winning and protecting win protect win protect see uh, i'm gonna talk about a few things that really make i'm gonna look at the chat we're gonna look at the chat i'm gonna talk about a few things that make people stall in trading when it comes to results all right but before that guys guys talk to me i know i know you a lot of people got some good questions has been your experience, all right? No, we had we had we had some some changes in communications, but ha has been your, you want to get all your team connected, you want to get your groups connected, okay? Yeah, uh, I I like to connect at a very selfish level. I want to be close. I want to be selfish with the community, with the team. I I really don't want to feel like I'm distant, so that is why I come on here, okay? Mm to do this ah oh, man okay Okay, so I got a question there. How to win and protect? Okay, good. Mm. Okay, Miss Temi, I joined. Okay, I am October 3rd. October 3rd of last year. Or oh, October? Are we? Are we in October yet? <laughs> I'm feeling I'm I'm feeling like no, we're not in October yet. Okay. No no no, I'm not going to trade. I'm just gonna educate you on a chat, alright? Okay. Good. I caught what I wanted to ask. You know, uh, after the live yesterday, I still went ahead and I asked the question. I put I put out the question. How many of you were on live yesterday? Put live before we meet live yesterday on Instagram. Okay. All right. I I, I put live. Uh, I put out the live we had yesterday. And I asked the same question. Between a successful trader and a skilled trader, all right, even the question that I put under the video, many people, I've got, I've got about 80, 85% off. Can you see, can you see what world we live in? 80% of the people still went for skilled and both. Go look at the video I did yesterday. Go look at the response of the, the answer. Now, someone comes into the seat. See, you know what you're dealing with. This helps you know what you're dealing with every day. People come in with, the, with, a, with, a, with a stagnant mindset. All right? They come in already with, in the direction of what? Constant trouble failing ex that's why a lot of you have a failing experience all right because the focus the desire it's a good one to be a skilled trader but it's a lesser one to be a skilled trader and you know someone even emphasized that uh without skilled you cannot be successful what a big lie what 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 a limiting belief what a limiting thought all right you could be a successful trader without even knowing how to trade in fact, we have more successful traders who don't know how to trade more than those who know how to trade. Do you guys know that? 
Mm -hmm. We have more successful traders who don't know how to trade. Do you know that in this academy, you have more people who are students making money than people who are educators? You have more chairmen who are making money more than the educators. Do you guys know that? <laughs> All right. We have more chairmen making more money. They are successful in trading. All right. Because they know how to leverage over the education, over the platform. They know how to leverage over the educators. The educators don't make more. Some of you are more successful than the educators. Yeah, we have some extreme successful educators, all right, but a few. But the numbers of people having success from leverage is way more wide. They know how to leverage. You don't have to be skilled, a skilled educator, a skilled trader to make money. It has no relationship. All right. It has no skill has no relationship with success. The only it has a contribution but no relationship. It will contribute to in the sense that it gives you focus and direction, but it doesn't. All right, it's it's not related. Success is one. One. Now it's one. <laughs> they are even they are even bringing it down. We used to say one to ten percent skill, but now it's one percent skill, ninety nine percent covers mindset mindset mind management risk management all of those things so this is what i tell people 10 percent is the skill all right risk management 30 percent and the mindset is 60 percent so tell me why you think your skill is what's going to make you successful why who told you that and you see, that is why I really understand and I love this environment when I finally understood. I really finally understood why people fail, right? Why people come in here and fail. Because why? They admire the little things. If I hold a trading session, it's going to be packed out with people. But if I, have, if I have a mindset training, I don't need that. You already see why people fail. Like as I'm talking right now, someone is saying, are you going to trade? He's more interested in trading than the vision see these talks that are this wealth that are that are coming out there is a mental blockage it's not entering but if i say euro usd why you're limited to the small stuff you always get small stuff when your paradigm is small you're in a small box you guys get it all right so when you're in this environment that's why i love to do this because people i've got so many messages on my dm and i have time to go through a lot of them i just see lots of testimony recently why because people just listen to me my six figure traders that are moving into seven figure traders by the grace of god right now i don't hold sessions of trading with them i don't even train them on trading i just have what i do is that if i see that you're putting in the work i get you close and i communicate more because in my life my communication is my wealth so the more i communicate with you it's going to change the more you even stay in my environment and listen to me it's going to change how you think because what you hear what you see will affect what you think and what you think will produce what you say and what you say creates the reality so trading comes from already created reality it comes from the mindset so you must be successful before you become a successful trader all right you before you become this skill you're even talking about you have to be successful before you get skilled <laughs> wow god help me break this down for your children mm. i just dropped a strong one A plain term is this. The school has anything to do. The certificate you go earn in school has anything to do with your wealth. So that is that is one that is very close to everyone. Do the degree you have has anything to do with the money you earn? Or the wealth? Does it have anything? Does degree has anything to do with wealth?
but we could liken degree to skill you went you acquired a lot of knowledge skill right but does that have a relationship to do with the kind of money you earn no no you guys should say yes so you better say yes yes because a lot of people are acquiring degrees that are way more than that are higher hotter that temu mentor but does it have anything to do with riches do you know one thing that is even worse about degrees it sets you up for slavery likewise the skill in trading the more you know how to trade guess what you're going to do you're going to stay with the market too because what you do what you know is what you're going to do you want to be in fellowship with them because that is what you learn skill you would be slave to the market when you go bizarre on the what some of you that are learning the wrong way you trade more than i do but i'm more skilled and successful more than you are i see i've not gotten into the market I don't spend more than an hour in the market. I'm a skilled trader, but I was first a successful trader before I became skilled. That is the big one you guys don't understand. And I'm going to break it down. I was first a successful trader before I became a skilled trader. I know you guys are, you, you guys, you're wondering, right? I'm wondering, you say yes, I'm wondering, right? <laughs> So it's it's almost getting into a series right now. So we're continuing from the, the yesterday. So I said I'm gonna go, I'm gonna show you guys a chart. All right. So what should I do? Should I continue on this or I show you the chart? Mm, two things. It just came up. Just took over. All right. The word just took over. Should I drop the word or I had a plan to maybe ask a few questions and show you something good. I want to show you. I think I may still have time to do that. And I don't really want to exceed the time. Or a thought is coming right now. I think I need to drop it. So your choice. Should I drop this thought or ah oh man, this is rich. <clears throat> you know, if I hear somebody tell me that I, I I'll first be a successful trader before I'll be a skilled trader, I would want to know why. What, what what does that mean? All right. If you don't if you don't get your groups in here right now they be missing out because not everybody ha not everybody know how to get it vibe when they recorded but some know how to get it live you want to you want to send this out put it on your status this is real you want to send it out that's the word send it out right now someone is going to get blessed with this okay someone is going to get blessed a lot of people do ask me the dm me this okay give me the word how can i do this how can i do this it comes from the mindset it comes from the word so i want to say i want to give you guys a guide on what you set your focus on all right i became a successful trader before i became this skilled all right so the degree someone goes to school to go get does it have anything to do with the riches they earn or the worth they earn from it you said no so why do you think you getting skilled in trading has anything to do with the money you're going to earn from it? What's the relationship? <laughs> Some people don't know. Why? The deception that they get is the person who is teaching them was skilled. That is why they made money. Isn't that what you guys think? All right. You think my skill helped me make money, so I'm in the position to teach you because I have made money because of the skill. Is that, that is, isn't that what you guys get? Because that is the, the, the signal that comes out when you see anybody train you. You think they are skilled, so you want to learn the skill and be like them. No, you have to be like them before you learn the skill. Before the skill. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, this is deep. Before they became influential, that the skill is known, they were first successful success is a capture of the mind consistently over a period of time so before i became a trader i already was successful in trading in my mind because if i wasn't successful i wouldn't break through the walls of challenges how Kenry? what do you mean man is it gonna go deeper it's gonna spend time ah. you're not gonna break through if there's no force so for everyone who breaks through have the power to hit the force okay so let me take next request 
when next before next came to seven figure in income he was already a successful what uh he was already a successful trader before he came to seven figure in income in his process of learning he already had success all right that on that see let me tell you do you know when you know you're successful you gotta write this down when you know you're never going to quit that gut feeling that will make you do anything not to quit all right would you quit mm -mm. would you quit on what you do you know that the reason you're not going to quit is when you already know you have it you can't let it go all right you have it you can't let do you know why people quit never believed in the first place they've not seen it they've not captured it success is a capture of the mind not what you see outside is a capture of the mind i know seven figures is done from what i've seen so the moment i see it and i play it together i know it is done if i figure and capture it in my mind and i have that undying will to run after it without quitting that is when i become successful all right i know i'm dropping this this is wealth i'm dropping with you guys but i'm already as much as i want to create walls i'm trying to separate this this training from some people because they don't value they don't know what this is i'm just i don't know i have a big heart to just just let if i get in this this spirit i don't know why this spirit loves you guys okay so why did i lose a whole lot of money lose money that wasn't even mine sold cars paid subscription for a whole almost a year and i didn't i wasn't trading but i was connected why why was i stupid was i an idiot was i being brainwashed no there was a capture of the mind that i was already a success This skill caught up with me being successful. The skill didn't make me successful. The skill caught up because why? If I had quitted, I'm already a failure. I wouldn't be skilled. You're not gonna be skilled if you're not successful. That is why you won't follow someone who doesn't have the success even if they are skilled, would you? Yes or no? Mm -hmm. would you so the success qualifies the skill no skill qualifies the success you guys have been going it way wrong back just trying to point it straight the success there are a lot of people who you don't follow today they are skilled traders very skilled <laughs> they know they, they are well skilled but what qualifies a skill is the success that qualifies the skill so success comes first before skill you guys never knew Cambry all right Every new how to trade long ago, but the moment success was captured, the skill was qualified. It's not the skill that made people know me, it's my success that made people know me. So, what's the desire of a man? Desire to be successful, the skill will be known. And can I tell you the truth? It doesn't have to be big. Whatsoever is known by success qualifies the skill. So you may only know support and resistance. People will follow you because of support and resistance. They don't want to know nothing else. They will tell you that support and resistance is the skill. 
it qualifies whatsoever you know your success so someone may know fib extinguishing fire collapsing curve know all of those stuff and don't have results and someone may just know support resistance technique and you say ah no those things are used you would say you would say those things are useless why what qualifies the skill is the success you see in the person i know i've i've, I've touched somewhere deep in you guys right? i know you guys are excited about this thought right so what you demand the focus on focus on the success not the skill the skill is useless it's all, the truth is the skill is almost useless in the why you know why i say it's almost useless do you know people can follow you just because you're a good follower not because you are the leader say so you know what this guy is a good mentor all right and what the mentor just does is he leverages over someone else they will say this is the skill the leverage is the skill say this guy is good in trading he knows how to leverage <laughs> say the, oh no i will learn how to leverage because that's what makes you successful people will follow you because of the, the skill what really is skill is what br brings the success it's not the technicality you guys are missing it all wrong it, no, no 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 do you know what's my skill communication i communicate results when you hear me that's my skill all right that's my skill that is my way with you so and because i communicate result it happens with the technical that's my success so the technical has a way of playing at following my communication I have a confidence of what's going to play out in the market. Why? I've done it over a period of period, period of period of time. All right? It has nothing to do with money. Mm -hmm. I know you guys are schooled. Am I schooling you guys right now? All right? Put blessed. Blessed. If you're getting blessed right now. Okay? If you're getting blessed right now. New dimension. Put new, new dimension information. Just put it on the chat. You guys just got a new dimension information. All right, put it on the chat. Mm -hmm. So why do, do you guys know why? If so, if someone asked me, I've been, if you have been thinking you're going back and forth, check, check where the focus was. You're going back and forth because you're not yet successful. You've not captured some of you say i don't have money for my next subscription is because you have not what captured the success some of you say all right i'm not making money yet yeah it's because what you're not yet captured success if you capture success you do whatsoever you can would you let something wealthy to leave you why would you let something you know you have leave you for a mere excuse it's because all right can you guys wow i almost skipped my network I thought it was gonna trip off. Hope someone is recording. Hmm. Hmm? So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna conclude the session and I'll see. Then we'll come back to the, for the, for the other short session. So that because I want these videos to be separate of what I'm gonna do technically. Does that make sense? So that I want it short uh i want a shot i could take the clip and uh yeah put it on put it on the youtube so what what, what was my journey all right so why why do i keep hammering on people going on the wrong direction all right because being an educator i've got large following why do people follow me the majority of the people that follow me don't follow me all right for the right reason they follow me because I have the results. Now, that's not a bad thing. People, yes, yeah, success has great company. But you that is following, 
you must follow for the right reason before you can get the right results so you dm me you send me a message you tell me the problems all i want to see is what are you, why are you telling me the problems i want to know i can't sell people not everybody i can't sell but the truth is the moment i know you're telling me the problem the problem the reason you're telling me the problem is think okay i'm going to solve the problem no i can't solve your problem your problem was already solved before they came. If it wasn't like that, then you're in trouble. How? I already knew I was going to face challenges. Is it when you go through the fires? Don't get dismayed. I'm with you. You're not going to be burnt. All right? So I already knew I was going to go through problem. All I just need to do, I need someone, all right, who's in my field, who's gone, probably gone through the problem, to tell me, all right, what they did. Not solve the problem for me. They can't solve my problem. They just need, I need to just know what they did. So I just seek their communication. That's all. I don't tell them to teach me. No. Teaching won't solve my problem. Because that's not, that's not what created the problem. Some majority of you follow me because you want me to teach you. The teaching is not what brings the skills, the environment I give to you. Hearing me talk. You see this thing right now? It's not the skill. But you see this thing right now I'm doing? It's going to make you more successful than those that seek the skill. Those that seek the skill, we keep seeking the skill for life. But those that seek the right environment will become the environment for life. You guys get it? It's my life. What created the problem was not the skill. So the skill is not going to work. So you guys think you blew your account, you're in trouble. No. What makes you in trouble is when you quit blowing account because blowing an account is an experience of the skill it is not an experience of failure no no it's an experience of the skill just because you blew your account doesn't mean you're a failure all right that's an experience with the skill eventually all right the skill has a timeline where you were gonna you're gonna make mistakes stand stand run run fly jump eventually the skill will produce its result in the journey but the, you're not gonna you're gonna you're not gonna stand if you stay on the floor or decide not to stand up again what is gonna make you decide to stand up again even when you fall stand up again even when you fall is when you're already successful you know why you should stand up and you're convinced you're never gonna stay so you pursue that thing will it's an inner capturing of the mind you're not going to question. A lot of people's question. So I have fallen. They told me if I stand in this place, I will never fall. Now I have fallen. I said it before. I do not like this ground. I do not like this environment. They keep deceiving people. You know you whine and quiet. These are the failures. You question everything that is happening in a 10%, less than a 1% environment. You're carried away by the happenings. Why? Because there is no capture of the mind. You've not captured success. You make excuses for all of the baby nagging. Yeah, yeah, I joined the session. You said the thing has not gotten to 305. Uh, it, it, it got there. I just clicked and I lost the trade. And you guys said you won. You whine, you whine, you whine over small things. Why? You don't know what you're carrying. If you know what you're going to, you're going to shut your mouth, shut your brain and tell yourself, shut up, I'm successful. Shut up. Shut up. Don't tell me things I don't need. Shut, you shut yourself down. Kill the voices that don't support. Keep your mouth clean. Because when you keep your, when you shut that voice down, it's a carnal voice. And to be carnally, carnally minded means you listen to carnal experience. It's death. It means you're going to fail. But to be spirit-minded, the words, the feeling, ah, I know what it is to earn a thousand a day. For me to earn a thousand a day, it means I don't have to quit by losing a five hundred dollar account, a thousand dollar account, ten thousand dollar. I have to get over that. All right, that is the skill. But what will make you get over it is a feeling, is a capture of success. So that is what happened to me. I blew those accounts, but I was. I was intact. It affected me, yes. But I told myself, <laughs> look at this word, write it down. It has come to pass. You guys writing it? It's the word. 
the word. I live in the word. And the word says, it has come to pass. You know what I do? I deliver. I can deliver the pain. I say, cast your cares and your burdens. I take that burden out of me and I deliver it to the word. This trouble, this feeling of a blown account has come. I give you to pass. It will pass. It has come to pass. So every stagnant account has come to pass by the word. Every beginning was the word. So the moment I say blowing account has come to pass, it came and it passed. Now I can never blow an account again. Why? Because it had a beginning. It has come to pass. I was first successful before the skill showed up. <laughs> so now no matter what I do with the skill, I can never blow an account. But I was first successful with the word. Are you getting it? All right. Mm. See, I get it. Success is internal. What is ever going to show up on the outside of a man's life will first be created. The outside is reproduced. See, you only reproduce what you have created. Anything that shows up on the outside must first be created, must first be produced. Outside is reproduction, inside is creation. So I created my success the moment I captured it, I taught it, I felt it, and I said it, and I acted it. So the skill is the acting of what you created. So every day I go on and I learn, even while I'm sleeping, I wake up, I slap myself. Why? I had to create, I had to reproduce what I've created. I had to reproduce. So I blow account, I shift it away. That was account. That's not what I created. That's the skill. It will show up. It, say, I will go through the fire, I will not get burned. So when those things, I put it past. Uh, I keep on keeping on. Why? I'd created it. I have to reproduce it on the outside. So I now have to learn the skill to reproduce what I'd already created. So success came from when I produced it inside. So you guys now know why you're following me, right? How many of you now know why you're following me? Mind shift. Put it on the chat mind shift have a way to shift your mind all right just listen to the words the skill is a show off the show off it's not what makes you successful the skill produces the success you have created in our environment knowing how to buy the support and resistance is a reproduction of what has already been produced. So what have you produced? Started this session with what's your why? What are you living for? What's your motivation? What's that inspiration? All right. I believe this is just a part of it. All right. We're going to get deep. For, for, um, yeah. Take our time. I'm, I'm, I'm creating a course, all right, a mentorship course that's going to take you guys through the journey of them. Of, yeah, you're going to get it soon. So whoever is interested, I want to go through this journey. Man, God is faithful. Look at what he just gave to you guys. See how amazing it is to stay. I, t I tell you guys two things. Stay connected, follow instructions. Just see the power of staying connected. A lot of people are not on this call. Just imagine you have a group you, you didn't get on this call. Just imagine you had a group you were with on this call. If you have been blessed and they, ble they were blessed at the same time, what is going to happen to you, your team? All right? So I love you guys. So I'm going to stop this right now. I'll show you a few things, just a few things on what I wanted to show you on the chat. But I want this video separate. So super congratulate you guys bless i'm ending this now i'm gonna come up all right bye